Everybody stop clapping and let the energy completely leave the room and then bring it up again. Yeah. I think we can all feel that that was kind of a late. That was late. You were there. You were the only person. Let's have one guy in the front row really get excited on behalf of everybody else! Yeah! <laughs> that made me horny a little bit for a second. Okay, does everybody know what they bought a ticket to tonight? No. No, perfect. That's the perfect way to start this off. This show is called Surrounded, mainly a cuz. You guys are doing that right now. This is a crowd work show. We just talk to you guys and try to figure it out. Isn't that fun? I'm the host. My name is Mike Falzone. This is my show. I'm gonna come up in between the comedians and go over what we've all learned about each other. Okay? And if that doesn't work, we'll just all, we'll take a step in and then we'll all fucking just be inside of each other by the end of the night. And that'll work out. You got very excited about that. And you kind of look upset that she's excited about that. So I know a lot about you guys already. You're dressed like a Ninja Turtle, that is fun. Anybody else, before we go any further with this, anybody else dressed like a Ninja Turtle? Or is it just the one? Same guy with his hand from before. Nice. So the best way to do this is to get acquainted with each other, and we're gonna keep it light so no one gets nervous. Miss, what's your biggest fear? <laughs> when was the last time you cried? Speak up. No, 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 what's your, what's your name? Karina. Hi, Karina, I'm Mike. How are you? This is what the show is. <laughs> Pretty good so far, right? Yeah, it's nerve-wracking for me, too. I ate a lot of cheese, and then I drove four hours to be here. <laughs> we got any cheese heads in the bar? Yeah, the same guy from before. Dude, I'll get to you, I promise. But you gotta shut the fuck up. <laughs> There's so many people in between. Katrina. Karina, I said. <laughs> Give me a break, man. I'm half asleep. Do you know the person that you're sitting across from? I do. And how? Don't make me guess, Karina. Oh, uh, he's my husband. That's your husband. Yes. So I'm guessing you guys have made out. <laughs> What's his style of making out? Is he open mouth guy or what? <laughs> we're all just learning. What? We're taking shots in the dark. Is he good at kissing? Good kissing guy? Yeah, you wouldn't marry someone who's a shitty kisser. Is anyone here actively with a shitty kisser? Hold on, first, I should have done this first. Everybody close your eyes. <laughs> close your eyes and then raise your hand if you're here with a shitty kisser. Go ahead. <laughs> the only thing the guy in the back didn't raise his hand. <laughs> That's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, I get it. <laughs> How long have you known each other? You don't want to say it. You don't want to participate. Wait, what was the question? You're her. I'm not gonna let you know. Well, now you can answer as a team because I know that you're married. 18 years. That's beautiful. Everyone made a sound like, you could do that? Yeah, guys, you don't have to fuck someone and never talk to them again. You could be together for 18 years. Are you hearing this? How long have you two been touching like that? <laughs> One day. <laughs> so much more excited for you guys. 18 years. You know how many one days are in 18 years, you fucking idiots? <laughs> you guys haven't done shit yet. Yeah, yeah. Uh, do you have any advice for that? Karina, good luck. Do you find that helpful? No, good. And how, which app did you guys meet each other on? Pretty good gas, right? Did you? Hinge. That's the one where doors fall up. I haven't been on all the apps, but I'm pretty sure. Uh, is, 
does somebody have to make the first move, or is that an equal opportunity situation? I'm a 2022 person, so it's equal opportunity. Sure. <laughs> I think we can all agree that was kind of an extra answer, but it's the one that we were doing. Uh, did you, who talked to who first? You guys don't remember? This started a day ago. <laughs> We're gonna get more in depth. I'm gonna ask you the what's your biggest fear question next. You don't remember who talked to who first? I think I did. You think you did. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna ask you what you said, but there's no chance in hell that you remember what you said. Uh, she had a picture of going through Catalina backpacking. Like, yeah. Wow. Damn. <laughs> and now you're here. Were there any telltale signs that it was Catalina? Like, was she standing in front of a Catalina sign? Whoa, is that Catalina? Yeah, dude, how'd you fucking figure that out? <laughs> yeah, just, just okay, yeah, tight. So you're both rich? <laughs> and that is fun? No, that's fun. <laughs> and are you having, is this your first date? Oh, you're, oh, poor people. Yeah, poor people do backpacks. <laughs> You ever seen one of those cartoons where they got all their shit in a handkerchief on a little stick? The guy in the back. <laughs> what did you say? <laughs> oh, yeah, dude. I believe you. I believe you. Um, so that's beautiful. Is your, this your first date? That's awesome. And what an awkward situation I'm putting you in. So you should, it's not fair. You're 100% right. So let's go over the things that you two should know about each other if you're gonna continue dating. <laughs> you guys don't do it, I'll do it. Too many cooks in the kitchen. Dude, how funny is it to be on your first date and there's fucking 80 people? <laughs> Man, I hope we have a good time. Even if you went to a place where it was just you two, it would be nerve wracking. And now there's 80 people being like, what are you gonna say next? But don't think about that. Um, let's go over the main points. What is your name? Megan. Megan. Did you know that before you got here? <laughs> You're off to a great start. Megan, I'm going to ask you a yes or no question, and you have to answer honestly. You fucking racist, Megan? No. Good. <laughs> Hold on, before you clap, before you clap, there's one more person. <laughs> Megan, and let me guess your name. Matt. Right, kind of looks like a Matt. What's your name? Eric. Eric, that's Matt with an E. Are you a racist guy? Not normally. <laughs> What's halfway in between a red flag and a green flag? I'll do the jokes, Matt. <laughs> you piece of shit. I'm just kidding. You guys are doing great. And uh, just real quick, uh, how many people have you had sex with? No, I'm just kidding. That's not my business. It's not my business. It's not Megan's business. It's none of our businesses. What happened here? Do you think? Why is there fucking 120 people in this tiny bar and there's one? You gotta put that one empty seat in the front row? All right, hold on. You don't tell me who to sit here. A thousand ushers. All right, what is your name? Hi, Christine. I'm Mike. That's Megan and Matt. <laughs> kind of, right? Are you single? No. You're not single. And what kind of relationship are you in? What kind of relationship? Monogamous one. Fair answer. With a, a man, a female. Good. And where are they at tonight? Did not feel like coming to this. He doesn't have as good uh, taste in comedy as I do. Yeah, hell yeah. How do we get you out of this relationship? You know, when you start dating people, the first thing you always see is, I, I gotta have looks, I gotta be attracted to the person. 
and they have to have a completely different sense of humor. <laughs> That's great, man. Anybody want to sit here? Any single people who aren't creepy as fuck? No, you, you gotta stop with the hand. <laughs> Give me one good reason why you should sit here. That's a pretty good reason. <laughs> and you know he's not gonna try to hit on you if he's in love with me. Do you wanna sit here? Maybe. No, you know what? You lost your chance. <laughs> What'd you say? Are you gonna take my back to you? Am I gonna take my back to you? <laughs> Are we gonna fuck on this stage? <laughs> if it's funny, I'll do it. But if it's not funny, I'm not fucking this guy on stage. I think we could all agree. What is your name, dude? Joan. Hi, Joan. Mike. <laughs> dude, I like you a lot. What? Karina, please. Do you want to sit here or no? This is a fleeting. No, Karina is wiped up to this guy. <laughs> Karina belongs to other Matt. <laughs> no, you stay in the back and you be single with all the rest of the back people. <laughs> we'll figure out a place for you by the end of the show. We just kick him out. <laughs> the cops come, like, we got a call. <laughs> good, good. <laughs> Keep being good. How are you guys? Happy, what a beautiful way to be. And which app did you meet? <laughs> Purdue West. What? Purdue. Purdue? The school, or the chicken people. <laughs> a school. Nice, how long are you, I'm assuming you're together? How many years have you been together? 38 years. 38 years. 40. Karina? <laughs> what was the first thing that attracted you to this young lady? Her blue eyes. You don't get that anymore, do you? What was the first thing that attracted you to this guy? He was cute. It's kind of like saying your whole face has blue eyes. And what attracted you to this beautiful young lady? Her smile. What a nice, kind, warm feeling. What was your name, sir? Sam. Sam, you fucking racist or not? <laughs> he said no, and he said no right away. And that's beautiful, that's a beautiful thing. This is the first time we ever did this show in San Diego. Do you want it to come back? Would you come back? That guy's not coming back. But all the rest of you guys come back. Thank you so much for making us feel so welcome. You guys were a perfect audience. Thank you so much. Bye-bye. Baby girl, love my bop and unlike me too. No roof on my top and my babe see-through. Hating on the pen, don't stop. Shit ain't gonna feed you. I've been all on my ground, so why I need you?